And with that, Mr. Speaker, let's talk about the rule before us. The rule before us today makes an order, H.R. 3967, the Honoring Our Pact Act. As an Iraq War veteran, I believe supporting toxic, exposed veterans should be of the highest priority. Approximately 3.5 million veterans who served our nation after terrorist attacks of 9-11 were exposed to open air burn pits and other toxins. Many of these troops now suffer from serious health issues, including rare and aggressive cancers, respiratory conditions, and other illnesses. Yet they face significant barriers to obtaining help from the VA. These men and women put their lives on the line to, to defend our freedoms. We must provide them with the care and benefits they've earned. That's why I'm disappointed that we're here considering H.R. 3967, rather than voting on the Health Care for Burn Pit Veterans Act, a bipartisanship bill that's already passed the Senate by unanimous consent. If we took up that bill immediately, it could be signed into law by the end of the week, ensuring swift delivery of life-saving care for toxic exposed veterans. But instead, here we are prioritizing a bill that must still, go, still undergo a lengthy analysis process, many legislative considerations. We also have to look at the impact on the current VA and the, uh, those that are getting benefits now from the VA and the backlog that exists in our VA system. Republicans want to quickly deliver help to veterans suffering from toxic exposure. The best way to do that is to bring the Senate passed Health Care for Burn Pit Veterans Act to the House floor. Prioritizing H.R. 3967 will only slow down the process and delay implementation of toxic exposure benefits. I therefore urge my colleagues to oppose this rule and I reserve the balance of my time.